Okay, here we are in the uh, greenhouse and we're continuing on our freaking out process of the tomatoes. We got a little Afro cube and jazz in the background because uh, that's the only sunshine that these tomatoes are going to get today. But generally, perking out is great when it's done on a day like this because uh, it's a little bit, uh, well, less intense for the sun. We don't have to worry about drying out the roots or burning things. And also, it's a lot more comfortable to like work up a sweat by <laughs> dancing around like this than it is to uh, uh, be sweating here in the greenhouse at noon trying to prick out your tomatoes. So we've taken these tomatoes out of their first flat, which we're calling uh, breakfast. I'm gently pulling apart their roots and we see nice healthy roots and we're being as careful and delicate as we can with these uh, little things, you know. I'm going to call them babies just for the sake of uh, now because everyone's nice to babies. Uh, we're making a hole in the flat. You can see I already have most of the flat um, pricked out. Whenever I label things in the greenhouse, everything behind the label is that variety. So we have Gardener's Delight here up until this point where we move to the lemon drop cherry tomato. So I'm holding these very delicately and carefully. I don't want to J-root them, so I'm placing them in, slowly pushing a little bit of soil on top, firming, tamping down the soil, um, leaving the final level at just just uh, a little, the cotyledons or first leaves are maybe about a centimeter above the ground, firming the whole thing in, move on to the next tomato. 25 tomatoes in here. These are all indeterminate tomatoes. So these are going to grow grow in the tall tunnel cloche. Um, they keep flowering and growing and vining and getting taller and taller, unlike a determinant tomato that has a terminal bud, uh, makes all of its flowers, sets its fruit, and uh, you could also call those bush tomatoes, and these are sort of like a taller vining tomato. Indeterminant, uh, that's what I'm working on right here, cherry tomatoes bunch of other heirloom varieties and uh, here we are, pricking out the tomatoes.